2010 was a landmark year for Mercy for Animals. In our work to protect farmed animals, this year, MFA's Undercover Investigations Department pulled back the curtain on the cruel reality faced by animals on factory farms. And now something to think about the next time we all open the fridge. An undercover investigation has revealed the disturbing reality that some cows face. Mercy for Animals took their hidden cameras into a New York dairy and what they found will shock you. Unhealthy cows in filthy conditions, often subject to inhumane abuse. These animals are really treated as little more than milk producing machines. That's the question of got milk, now becoming Diane, how did you get that milk? Unfortunately, this horror film inside a Union County dairy barn is real. Video so graphic, animal rights groups say they've never seen anything like it before. Workers can be seen kicking, punching, and torturing cows and young calves. Video shot by an undercover agent with Mercy for Animals. Mercy for Animals. Mercy for Animals. Mercy for Animals. Now this man, Billy Joe Gregg, sits in jail tonight. He tortured these animals and he should be held accountable. We hope that this arrest sends a strong message to the dairy industry that animal abuse won't be tolerated. Sentencing today in one of the worst cases of animal abuse we've ever seen. Billy Joe Gregg Jr. pled guilty six times today. Guilty, Your Honor. Guilty, Your Honor. The same animal rights activists who released a video showing cows being beaten at a, a Union County farm have released another undercover video. Bob Barker narrating an undercover video reportedly taken at an Ohio farm which supplies veal to, among other stores, Costco. It shows young calves kept confined in small containers known as veal crates. This is absolutely heartbreaking. Animals with legs should be able to walk, run, and exercise. Undercover video shot by animal rights activists leads to a major decision by Costco. The Issaquah-based company says it will immediately stop doing business with a veal farm the group shot. Costco told us they're acting almost immediately, saying by the end of business today, their relationship with that farm is over. Your viewers have found out that veal ain't good. Maine Contract Farming will pay more than $130,000 to settle 10 counts of cruelty to animals. Early last year, the group Mercy for Animals went undercover and took this video. What we have found is that animal abuse runs rampant in egg farms nationwide. Bad eggs and expanding recall. 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 So far, over half a billion eggs are being pulled off the shelves. This undercover video obtained last year by the group Mercy for Animals. Mercy for Animals documented dead and dying, even decomposing chickens in the same cages with hens producing eggs for human consumption. Battery caged hens are confined in spaces so squalid and tightly confined that they can't even stand up, turn around, or spread their wings. Our growing team of volunteers staged over 700 pro-vegetarian outreach events across the country, including eye-catching educational exhibits, humane education lectures, delicious vegan feed-ins, and leafletings. In celebration of World Go Vegan Week, MFA worked with over a dozen popular restaurants in various cities to offer new vegan options. There's no meat, mm -hmm. no dairy. There's a global shift towards going meatless, and here's one opportunity to, to take part of that trend. From billboards to bus ads, MFA brought our thought-provoking vegetarian ad campaigns to tens of millions of people this year. MFA opened its newest grassroots office in Dallas, Texas, bringing our life-saving campaigns to the heart of cattle country. Hundreds of MFA members celebrated compassion and diversity by marching in pride parades in various states, bringing home the message that no one is free when others are oppressed. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. For making 2010. 2010. A landmark year for Mercy for Animals. Join us in helping more animals in 2011.